Hi, my friends call me Lyman. This is what you had to say about your fire. My fire is money. Done. Boom. I win. <laughs> sure. My fire is always wanting to create. My fire would have to be Rocket League. My fire is speed painting. So the word fire can be used in different ways. In this video, I was using the word fire in a very specific way. I was rather referring to what you want to express. Painting, for example, is more about how you want to express things. So let's take another example. Let's say that you truly love writing. Now, you can write until your fingers bleed, but it's not until you start expressing emotions and messages through your writing that you're actually going to make people feel something. And so whenever you create something, you first have to ask yourself, what do I want to express? And that is what I'm asking for. Now, I've also seen a lot of people typing that their fire is making people feel various things or helping people. And to that, I have a word of warning. I have seen lots of people in the comments losing their will to make videos because they didn't get the response that they were hoping for. So making oneself dependent on the reactions of other people might not be the best idea. Now, what you want to make other people feel and what you want to do for other people, that is of course important, but in the model that I'm using here, that is rather the result of the fire. So let's take a comedian as an example again. Now, he might love to make people laugh, but that's not the fire that I'm talking about. And he might love the art of making people laugh and the art of making jokes, but that's still not the fire that I'm after. What I'm after here is what he wants to express through his jokes. He might have a frustration about politics and he gets that frustration out through jokes and so make other people laugh and through these things make people feel what he wants them to feel, make them laugh. So it's rather the result of the fire and the way that he expresses it. Adventures of Well Um Me says, I love expressing my enjoyment or dislike for the games I'm playing. If I believe a game is bad, I like to show the stress and suffering I experience having to endure it. But more so, I love to express the enjoyment I get while playing games with amazing stories that I get hooked on. I feel as though through sharing the passion and emotion that comes out of these experiences is a good way to find an audience who enjoy the same content as me. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Sir Poggy says, can't never could do anything. I never actually heard that expression before, but I get exactly what you're saying. Your success is actually heavily dependent on whether you believe that you can make it or not. However, while it's true that can't never could do anything, I'm not sure that can always can do everything. Now, people have different talents, and so to me, it's all about picking your battles. I mean, I, for example, struggle to make jokes that is nothing that comes naturally to me. And since I don't need to make jokes, I see no reason to put months or years of energy into learning this art when I could be focusing on developing my talents. The Pandras says, you could say that this video is lit. I'm so sorry. My fire burns and it hurts. My fire burns, someone put me out, I've got no skin left. <laughs> Very punny. Get out of my comment section. So I hope these responses have been useful. I will see you in the next episode. Thank you for watching. Bye.